In today's video, I'll be trying out a bunch of myths and secrets around Brookhaven so we can discover if they're true or false. This girl's showing us how a pregnant woman's routine is in Brookhaven. She does all the regular stuff, eating, taking a shower. It's basically a video about a day in her own life. Also, I didn't know you could get pregnant in Brookhaven. That's kind of weird. How do we do that then? I really want to know. For that, we'll see this video that shows us how to look pregnant in Roblox. She apparently buys some clothes from the marketplace. Some of those layered clothes. After doing that, she changes her torso model with a chicken one and puts those clothes on to make it look like she's pregnant. With that, she's expecting inside the game. You can see that it does look pretty good. And of course, we're gonna try that one to see if it works. To start, we gotta go into the marketplace to buy some stuff. The one we have to get is this one. Telemon's business casual. Oh gosh, I look so damn weird with it on. I'm so ugly right now. <laughs> Anyways, Let's just get that right quick. Now on our avatar editor, we can equip just its torso, making us look like that. Of course, we're gonna have to change some stuff since my arms are just floating. So let's go and get this layered red flannel shirt. This one's just like mine. 50 Robux? Don't mind if I do. Just logged into Brookhaven for us to see how it looks. So let's go and refresh that avatar. Whoa, I actually look kind of pregnant. Look at my big belly. The only odd looking thing is the chicken's little thing still there on my neck. But of course, if we get the right clothes, our skin will look even better. But in this case, I look really bad. If we go into the search bar and look for pregnant, you'll be able to see a big variety of skins for what we're looking for. I can't even believe it, but I got a pregnant new. Look at him! But of course, beyond the noob, there's tons we can try out. In any way, this one's quite true. This video shows us regular Roblox faces that ain't as regular as you think. You can see that they're actually animated. Like whenever he dances, the face changes to suit the dance. There's even one with the noob. He's blinking all cute like that. I really like it. One of the faces he showed is actually the one I normally use, but the one I have doesn't really make expressions or anything like that. I'm even dancing to show you guys that it's just static nothing like the video yeah. so let's go to the marketplace here you'll find a bunch of faces that we can use but which one of these are those animated ones what about this one right here it looks kind of different as we try it on you can see it's animations already it blinks and everything there's another animated one here too but it seems to be too small for me i do love its animations though dude look at this one i just found it's a literal kitty face it's animated and everything you can even see the ear move. Oh, I think I finally found the one I was looking for right here. Look at it blink. I'm really not used to that. Beyond those, there's tons of these animated heads around the market. Some of them were already on Roblox and were just updated. But it's cool that we can have those kinds of animations on our avatar's face now. Do you know which is the weirdest of all the Roblox faces? This one you can only get if you buy this whole turkey model. Here's how Turkey Nando looks. Good golly. Why I say it's the weirdest one of all is because of the way it blinks. It's so bizarre. Like if its head came up and the eye went down a size, like you're squishing it. And if you're interested in the turkey model, you can get it for 75 Robux. In this video, he's trying to show some secrets about the new Brookhaven update. Here he's searching for agency and the accessories, and for some reason CIA stuff appeared. Now why is that? Then he looked for some shirts where he even got one himself. After that he searched for Wolfpack, which is the creator of Brookhaven, which gave him a selection of three exclusive shirts. He also found this weird little doll that sits on your shoulders, which is kind of spooky looking. Dude, I didn't even know Wolfpack sold exclusive items. Let's see what they are. But first, we'll look for agency in the accessories. It indeed shows us CIA clothes, which is this cool looking cap. Totally not kind of ugly looking. And also the armband with CIA written on the side. Now if we look for agency in the shirts, there'll actually be a bunch of agency clothes for us to use. One of the strangest ones is this one right here, which is written agency.exe with the symbol right on the lapel. Of course, there's a bunch of other shirts we can try on, but not many of them are interesting enough to talk about. Let's finally go and look for Wolfpack in the accessories. 
Sadly, there's no results for him in that tab. What about on the shirts then? Okay, there's some stuff here. Some actual Wolfpack merch. I say that because of the logo. You know this wolf right here? If we go into his profile, yes, this is the actual creator of Brookhaven's profile. We can go a bit lower to his group called Wolfpack Games with the same logo we saw on the shirts. I bet that this stuff you didn't know anything about. In this Brookhaven video, this guy asks, what is the house with the most secrets in the whole game? To discover that, we'll need to get that house right there. Look at that. It looks like there's a very cool secret with a whole hidden room of the house. Apparently, it also activates other secrets around the map, too. Here, we're in the game to test it out. Oh, you all right? Anyways, let's just go and test that video already. For some reason, someone left this car unattended. Whoever parked it is a bad driver, too. That's why I got my tractor to take this guy away from the streets. You can't stay like that. I'll put it in its rightful place. Whoa! Why did they delete it? I got sidetracked. Let's go and grab that exact house from the video. This one right here. In theory, there's a hidden room inside this little house. It doesn't seem to be down here. Down here is more of a bakery. At least they look good. What do we have up here? This just looks like a regular room. I don't see any secret stuff or hidden passages. All right, I'll just show you. If we jump on top of this picture frame and then once again, we'll find ourselves this secret attic room, which also also is where the safe is hidden. Yes, this is the exact same place as the video. It kind of looks like some sort of reunion room, right? There's some papers on the table, but they don't have anything written on them. But the most bizarre part is these sleeping cots on the corner. One big and one small. I'm really not sure why they're here. That's so weird. As if someone was just living up here this whole time, I'm getting the heck away from here. Let's go back to making your character have a pregnant belly in Brookhaven. I didn't really like like this one. It makes my shoulders go all weird. It's all wrong. Now this TikTok video will show us another way to do that same thing. The big difference with this one is that we won't need to spend any Robux to do that. First off, she buys that character model, which is totally free. After doing that, she only uses the torso and the arms from it just so they don't bug like mine. Then she just changes her character build a bit so it works better. Now she just puts on some nice layered clothes. With that done, she did quite a nice looking pregnant avatar. Doesn't it look cool? So here we are on the avatar editor. Let's grab this character right here, which apparently has an animated face as well. And quite an ugly one at that. Be careful if you see this guy out at night, guys. The thing is that the girl showed that the model was free on the video, but it actually is gonna cost us 75 Robux. Well, even if that's the case, I'll still buy it to show you guys. Now we just need to equip the torso. Look at my little belly. And then the arms so we don't look weird. To finish it off, I'll get a little crop shirt so we have a nice look. I'm inside Brookhaven, so let's go refresh our avatar. Dude! Oh gosh, why am I so ugly? This really doesn't match me at all, but this is for sure the best option. Better than that chicken one, and less expensive too. The method did work, but we will be needing to spend some Robux for this thing. So that's gonna have to be it for today, guys. I really hope you enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like on the video and comment down below what other Brookhaven stuff you want to see me test next. Make sure to watch one of the videos on screen right now. They're gonna surprise you. Go ahead and follow my Roblox profile too, at NandoYT. Just click the three little dots and then the follow button that you'll be able to play public games with me as well as be up to date with everything I do. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel for even more Roblox goodness. Have a good one!